Uh, my name is Kevin Rempel. I'm a Paralympic athlete and uh, an inspirational public speaker. You never know by looking at me, but I was actually paralyzed seven years ago. After crashing my dirt bike, I was in a wheelchair and doctor said I was never going to walk again. X-rays are taken, I've my, broken my back, my pelvis, my ribs, put a hole in my lung. And the doctors deemed me to be an incomplete paraplegic. I've had to deal with my paralysis, my dad's paralysis, um, overcoming my dad's suicide and, and uh, just maintaining a positive attitude through all this to like, actually want to like, achieve bigger and better things and, and not give up. My dad basically committed suicide because he couldn't cope with living with his injuries and, and felt that his life was over and uh, that just motivated me to do the opposite. I didn't feel that regardless of if you have an injury or whatever it is that um, life can still go on and I wanted to prove to myself especially more than anybody that you can make that happen. Every night before I go to bed for 10 or 15 minutes I would just stare at my big toe and be like move. <laughs> is being selective with your time. It's writing things down. Writing goals on paper is so powerful. You just gotta take the first step. Because once you take that step, then you get the next and the next, and you can see the next step, and you see the next step, and then all of a sudden, you're in the clouds. You know, I just started focusing on the things that I do have instead of the things that I don't have. And uh, I'm a big believer in goal setting. I created a vision board, and. I um, started just breaking down areas of my life that I wanted to do something with and um, just took it one step at a time. Just one day I'm just staring at it again, I'm like, oh man, I'm like, I did that and I did that and that and that and all of a sudden it's like, <laughs> I just did like five things on my vision board. But it was like every day I'm waking up, I put it right at the end of my bed and every day I'd wake up and it's like, yep, yeah, I'm going to do that someday, yep, I'm going to do that someday. I was just inspired by the entire story. Well, I really, really like it. It comes straight like from his heart. My story is powerful. People can relate to it on so many different levels. And no matter what it is you're going through, it's going to leave you with hope and inspiration that you can achieve great things in life as well. One of the biggest messages that I do want to deliver to people is that regardless of your circumstances, you don't have to have a story like mine. We all have challenges in one way or another. and. We can all relate to it. It actually uh, blew me away. I was uh, just very impressed and uh, there's a lot I could relate to as far as getting through hard times and uh, just finding that motivation. Well, my day started regular but now my heart is beating. I definitely was very, very much inspired. It's, um, it was amazing. As a speaker, I just like try and deliver a message about overcoming adversity and inspiring other people to do better regardless of what your circumstances are. I'm going to make it happen and I'm going to go as far as I can until I can't go anymore. It's, it's, it, there's, I don't think there's any words <laughs> to kind of go any further than that. It's just ma it makes me want to do more now than I ever have before. My name is Kevin Rempel and I want you to hear my story. <laughs>